Hi everybody, welcome to the Multivac booth here at Process Expo. My name is John, and our demonstration today is gonna to focus on the latest in thermoform fill seal packaging for ground beef, or other meat products for that matter. We're showing you this today in the context of a completely automated end-to-end -end processing and packaging line, starting from grinding all the way to the point where finished, inspected, retail-ready packages are positioned for cartoning and distribution. We have a lot to cover, so let's get right to it. Multivac is prepared to be your single source supplier for any ground meat packaging line. So that means we'll build your customized automated line from end to end, processing all the way to case packed product ready for distribution. When you partner with Multivac, you're going to have a single point of responsibility and accountability for your packaging installation, even when we incorporate systems from third party suppliers. What you're going to see today for purposes of this particular demonstration are, of course, Multivac's industry-leading thermoforming packaging machinery, and in this case, a high-speed R245 model, but also components from other vendors that we know and trust. This line begins on the other side, where a Hantman vacuum stuffer pumps the meat through a grinding head, shaping the ground meat in a continuous flow. By controlling the belt speed, setting the width of the plow and the timing of the portioning blade, the Hotman GMD portioner properly sizes the drafts of ground product and delivers its single file to the Tom multi-line loader. Here, triggered by photoelectric beam, the first servo-controlled retracting conveyor belt advances and then drops each draft onto the second belt space precisely to match the row centers of the formed pockets of the multivac thermoformer. The second servo-controlled retracting belt, set 90 degrees to the first, then builds the tracks of the array by traversing the rows of product. The completed three-track, four-row array, which is enough product to load two indexes on the packaging system, positions the product cantilevered over the loading area of the R245. Finally, having kept the drafts in complete control, the Tom MLL automatically loads the 12 drafts of ground product into the formed pockets below by simultaneously rolling the conveyor and retracting. The portions are vacuum packed and they're sealed with a top web of film that's already been printed using a Bellmark easy print thermal transfer printer. The printer is mounted on a traverse built by Multivax marking and inspection. After sealing, a Multivax vision system inspects the packages to ensure each has been properly printed in the previous stage. Now remember this detail here because the data we get at this point will really come into play in just a moment. This vision system is the first of three inspection stages that our packages are going to encounter. Okay, we're moving on. The Multivac UP labeler applies the label to the bottom face of the packages. Then, at this point, the packages are cut into single packages but still arrayed in three tracks and two rows. Now, just to note, at 12 to 15 cycles per minute, this line is simulating 72 to 90 one pound packages per minute. Now, these packages progress to the Multivac HO50 handling module, which is comprised of a two axis robotic arm with a two position vacuum gripper and effector. This is gonna allow the robotic arm to pick up two packages at a time and place them single file on the discharge conveyor. Now, you're gonna recall a moment ago when I mentioned the vision system upstream checking for package printing. Well, that data is transmitted to the Multivax line motion control, which tracks every single package traveling downstream. Any packages tagged by the vision system as non-conforming will not be picked by the handling module at this stage downstream. Instead, it will be left on the conveyor belt to drop into a reject bin. Only those packages conforming to the parameters that you set will proceed to the next step. Now, the final two inspection stages in our demonstration here today are a Berserba check wear and metal detector. 
Both of these units have their own auto reject functionality, which will discard unsatisfactory packages into another discard bin. Again, you control the parameters by which these systems will determine acceptability of a package. Finally, packages that have passed all tests are ultimately captured at the end of the discharge conveyor for end of line cartoning and distribution. You can see an example of an automated cartoning solution with our automation presentation with the Multivac T850 tray sealer, which we'll also have for you once each hour throughout the show right here at the Multivac booth. In summary, you've seen an example of a completely integrated ground meat line from grinding, portioning, packaging, printing, labeling, and finally inspection right up to the point of cartoning for distribution. Nobody has more experience in delivering cost-effective, reliable solutions to the meat industry. And we look forward to speaking with you about your projects. That concludes our presentation for this afternoon. Thanks for watching.